Recently, I went to Tennessee and visited Dollywood, but that's not the only thing I did in Tennessee. I also rode three alpine coasters, which were the Rocky Top Mountain Coaster, Smoky Mountain Alpine Coaster, and Goats on the Roof Alpine Coaster. Before the Tennessee trip, I never rode an alpine coaster, and just let me say that they look way crazier on front of views than they actually are when you ride them. So in today's video, I'll be ranking my top 3 alpine coasters I've ever ridden. So with that said, let's hop in. No, fuck that shit. Coming in at the number 3rd spot is Smoky Mountain Alpine Coaster, and this is my least favorite not even because it's not fun or exciting. It's at the number 3rd spot because it's honestly super shaky and feels very unstable. This Alpine Coaster was built way before the other two Alpine Coasters on this list, so keep that in mind. But man, this one was just super wildly. The number second spot takes us to Rocky Top Mountain Coaster. This one is definitely the smoothest of the three, but because it's so smooth, it doesn't feel very crazy. Which I know it, they're not supposed to feel crazy because the top speed you can usually reach on mountain coasters is like 30 miles per hour. But the next one is better than both of the ones I mentioned and you'll find out why right about now. The best mountain coaster of them all is Goats on the Roof, but I would say the coaster isn't the only reason it's placed at the number one spot. I was skeptical when it said Goats on the Roof, but there actually is quite literally Goats on the Roof. If I can't find a clip, I'll find a photo taken off the internet, but yeah, the coaster is great too, but the coaster is probably the second reason I put it at the number one spot. Because you can literally feed goats and they have gem mining which I didn't do but when I go back I'll definitely do it. So there you have it, my ranking of the three alpine courses of Tennessee. Overall, alpine courses are really fun, they're great for people who don't like the courses that enthusiasts like myself do. I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Horizon Thrill so you never miss a new upload. I make some of the most high quality roller coaster content you'll ever find on YouTube, all shot in 4K at 60 frames per second. But with that said, I'm Horizon Thrills and I'll see you guys on the horizon. Peace.